Wrestling is like a miniature battle between two guys who have strong wills. And in order for me to be successful in this sport, I have to break his will. My break didn't consist of, you know, having fun with friends or, you know, going out or living my best life. I woke up every day, 7 a.m., I had to get ready, get all my stuff, wake up, we gotta go to practice. Stay in your stage. Get your knees off the mat. There you go. We use his match because that that was actually referee's decision. He was right, but. Day one, usually your warm ups, they go by really quick. You're there with your whole team. Nobody's really a spotlight on you. You're not nervous. You're just trying to get through the day. Coach Sun pulls us aside, especially before the tournament begins, right after warm ups, and he gives us a little speech to calm our nerves. Make sure we're in the right mindset for the day, so make sure we're all good and we can get everything done. The tournament was super long. I was supposed to go to a bonfire after day one, and I was there until 9 o'clock. And the tournament started at 8 a.m. I'd be more of a newer kid, you know, a younger guy, freshman, sophomore from Woodland. Quarters, let me give you all some story time with Bryce Jones. First round, he was just pounded on my head. Second round, I got bottom, I got right up, straight back to it. Third round, he gets up, and I can see that he's finally tired. Now my move, I've been criticized for this, but I honestly, I just kind of step on the foot and just go for a leg and they usually topple over at heavyweight. It's my favorite move. It's my move. We get into overtime and the first overtime wrestling is sudden death. So I take a hard step on his foot, go right for the leg. He tried to score back one around both. He fell down. Two, match is done. It's a wrap. I won. I'm going to semis. I know what I'm going into is about to be one hard match. Go, go, go! Oh, I told you, Listen, no, keep him going. He comes out right in for a body lock and brought me straight to the ground. I was not expecting that. I was kind of shook. So I get down, he puts his head over his head and he grabs me. His, then he put me on my back and at that point I was, I was done, pin. Now I gotta go wrestle Conti's. Getting third kind of hurt. Ended up not where I wanted to be. I wanted to take Buford and then take State later. I lost. Took it like a man. But I knew Valdosta was coming up, so just got ready for that. It's so over winter break. You know, you're always, it's just, honestly, it's just a lot of wrestling. Need a stress reliever, so we had ourselves a little basketball game. And I went out there, my team, we went out there, we put on for the city and won the basketball wrestling championship. It's just how we do. NBA material. Going to the league. Go <laughs> son bodied Beverly. It was pretty hard. And yeah, that's that was, that was team basketball, you know? It gets pretty intense. <laughs> we handle ourselves with humidity. Humidity? <laughs> humidity. <laughs> humility? <laughs> I love the long car rides with the team. Usually I make a couple jokes, tell a couple stories, make fun of a couple people. I listen to mostly EDM and soft rap. Sometimes during the trip, I like to listen to musicals, and particularly my favorite, Hamilton. And I just, you know, do me on the car rides. I love long car rides and I love, you know, just being with the team. So we went to the mall. You know, I had a little fun team bonding thing. We went to Chick-fil-A, and all I could get was one chicken sandwich because I was close to weight, and it was sad. <laughs> but I had a good time with the team there, and, you know, that was the mall.
When we went for Vat Dost, it was off for me. I was not feeling it that day. But when I was warming up, that I was really out of it and I wasn't ready to wrestle. During a tournament, you have to find ways to pass the time because you're going to wrestle three times in a five hour span. Just let that sink in. So usually you talk about anything and everything you can find to talk about. You play on your phone. You just try to do anything to pass the time. This kid did not know what he was getting into. Did a step on the foot, grabbed his knee up, took him like this, put him straight to his back, done. Going through a tournament, it takes a toll on your body. The more matches you wrestle, the more of a toll it takes on your body throughout the day. So, my finals match went out there against this guy. Took him right to the mat real quick, got on top of him, ended it. Getting first felt good. Got my first bracket in a while. You know, big thing to hold up. It's good. Got on top of the podium. Everybody just was happy, and it was a good day. It was good to get first. What does wrestling mean to you? Uh, well, I've done it for 14 years now, so it's kind of it means the whole world to me. For me, it's just a means to vent and uh, get everything out and just be one with myself. Wrestling has shown me the meaning of hard work and to know not to be afraid.